subscribe now. What diet are you so, on? I'm on the keto diet. If your answer is are you that you're not on a diet, that means you're on the default diet. So the way it works is um, you're either on a consciously chosen diet, like for example, being a vegan, uh, being paleo, being carnivore, being keto, uh, any of those diets, you consciously chosen those diets. Right. But if you don't consciously choose your diet, then you end up on the default diet. And the default diet is known as a standard American diet. This diet is less than 100 years old and our bodies are not adapted for it. Our bodies are not evolved around this diet. And so it causes the body massive problems. So if you are on the standard American diet, which you are on, if you haven't chose consciously chosen a diet for yourself, you are, then you are on the standard American diet. And this is hands down the worst diet for the human body. It leads to uh, low energy. It leads to weight gain, which is, means you're sick. Uh, it means you're ill. It leads to a depression. It leads to mood swings. It leads to energy crashes. And if you ignore all of those, then it gets even worse. Then it leads to metabolic disorders. Metabolic disorders are where your metabolic system breaks down. It, your metabolic system is what keeps you in homeostasis. And when that system can no longer function and keep you in homeostasis, then you end up with a lifestyle disease, a metabolic disorder, like diabetes, type 2, high blood pressure, heart disease. High blood pressure, by the way, if, if you don't fix it, will lead to uh, heart disease. Uh, diabetes will lead to neuropathy, uh, where they will have to cut your hands and feet off uh, because the, there's not enough blood going there. Mm -hmm. Alzheimer's. Alzheimer's is also a metabolic disorder. Cancer. I know there's a cancer research and cancer institute and all that kind of stuff. But the reason most people get cancer, like 98%, there's some study done on this. Eating, they're on the standard American diet. So this is how bad the standard American diet, the diet that most people are on, the diet that people who don't choose a diet are on. They're on the standard American diet. And this standard American diet is designed to be addictive. So you overeat has no nutritional value, very little nutritional value, right? How much nutrition is there in a, in a McDonald's meal or a, or a cake or whatever, you know, or a donut, nothing, right? Those things are designed to cause you metabolic disorders. Uh, so if you're on the standard American diet, which is a sad diet, and that is a very good African acronym um, because the diet will make you very sad. If you're on that diet, then you have a lifetime. What you are doing is you're saving up for your future self misery and pain and depression and a low quality of life and on top of that you'll get the metabolic disorders like diabetes type 2 high blood pressure which then leads to uh, heart disease diabetes leads to neuropathy where they amputate your hands and feet not a fun thing to do at the hospital um, yeah. alzheimer's metabolic disorder They've, they've actually done some experiments with Alzheimer's they've taken some old people with early stage Alzheimer's and they've put them on the keto diet and within two weeks, their brain starts working in. They start remembering things. I've told this to people. And they're like, yeah, okay.